Welcome, Capricorn. Thank you for tuning in to your horoscope for January 2, 2024, on your channel, Zodiac Attraction. Discover what the future holds for you in terms of finances, lucky numbers, love, health, work, family, compatibility, and favorite color. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on daily updates. Get ready to explore your destiny. Let's get started. Capricorn, greetings to you, beautiful soul. Today we will explore the energies that surround you. Right now, you are starting a new chapter, full of intriguing possibilities. Whether in love or professionally, the Ace of Wands card and the Page of Cups indicate that there are exciting beginnings on your horizon. The key now lies in cultivating self-awareness. This is a favorable time to establish personal rituals and take care of yourself with kindness. Inner beauty and self-love are essential. Remember, I relax and the money flows. Let go of excessive worry and allow abundance to come naturally. Your current journey urges you to be aware of your personal powers. If you feel the shadow of an authoritarian figure, it's time to reclaim your power. Speak your truth and stand your ground firmly. Authenticity will be your guide on this journey. Preparation is essential as you set yourself on the path to accelerated spiritual growth. Take care of your body, your emotions, and your thoughts. The Ascension card suggests spiritual acceleration, but it will only be effective if you take proper care of yourself. Remember that accepting and forgiving are an integral part of your growth, and everything you have experienced has led you to be the magnificent person you are today. You may feel like others are trying to push you around this morning, dear seagoat, as the Leo moon and Uranus square off. Don't waste time on petty squabbles, as the unpredictable energy at play could take things in a strange direction. Check in with your emotions when the nodes of fate activate, acknowledging and releasing what you do not need. Feel free to change your perspective when Luna blows a kiss to Mercury retrograde, offering a chance to break patterns and evolve. Jupiter stations direct in your house of creativity tonight, bringing luck to your passion projects. You may have to trace back to the initial stages of few events. The cause for certain mishaps lay hidden in the roots. Your reputation in the eyes of others has suffered greatly because of this. It is very much necessary to be reserved and cautious in your approach lest people will try to be a hindrance in your quest. Relationships may feel like a moving target today as restless Mars locks horns with Drifter Neptune. A person you couldn't get enough of yesterday is suddenly draining you, or maybe you fear you've been ghosted after what felt like a cosmically orchestrated encounter. Even reading something disturbing on a social media feed could send you spiraling into paranoia. No, your SO probably isn't a narcissist, no matter what quiz you just took. You may want to respond with a 500-word text or make a decisive declaration, but don't. Not with hazy Neptune muddling your thoughts. Like a wave, this unsettled energy will wash over you. Just stand still, cap, and avoid getting sucked into the undertow. Jupiter ends its retrograde cycle today after almost four months of retrograde motion in your creativity sector, dear Capricorn. Jupiter's forward motion can help creative blocks lift. More clarity or enthusiasm may come to your love life, pursuit of joy, leisure time, or creative projects in the months ahead. Faith and optimism increase. You'll likely make more spontaneous and natural connections in the coming weeks. Your excitement or motivation surrounding love, entertainment, hobbies, and pastimes builds. Although this shift doesn't yield instant results, you'll gradually feel more optimistic about sharing yourself with others. With Chiron also now direct, something you may have buried or neglected will likely surface and demand attention. You're now feeling more equipped to handle problems in your personal life. With the moon in your solar 8th house today, your need to observe and reflect is stronger than usual, as processing your feelings and recent events seems essential now. In conclusion, Capricorn, this is an exciting time. Prepare your being at all levels and embrace the opportunities that arise. 
Look around you with unconditional love and accept your past as an essential part of your wonderful present. Trust in yourself and the journey that awaits you. Today's tarot reading for your sign. Card of the day, the Four of Pentacles, reversed. The Four of Pentacles card reversed suggests that today is an auspicious day to free yourself from self-imposed restrictions. You may have been holding on to something too much, whether it be emotional, material, or even your own safety. This is the time to let go and allow energy to flow more freely in your life. Remember the importance of opening yourself to new experiences and not restricting yourself excessively. You may have felt trapped in an overly conservative or fearful mindset, but today is the day to break those barriers. Influence of the Past, Eight of Cups The presence of the Eight of Cups in the past suggests that you have gone through a period of emotional and spiritual searching. It is likely that you have left behind certain aspects of your life that no longer served you. This emotional journey has led you to seek a greater connection with yourself and the universe. This is a reminder that past experiences have contributed to your personal growth, and you are now in a stronger, more aware place. Current Challenge, The Six of Swords The Six of Swords indicates that you are in the middle of a process of transition and change. The current challenge may lie in completely letting go of old ways of thinking or patterns of behavior that no longer serve you. You may face some internal resistance as you leave the known behind, but trust that this journey will lead you to calmer waters and greater mental clarity. Recommended Action, The Two of Cups The Two of Cups card suggests that today is a good time to look for meaningful connections in your relationships. This could involve a reconciliation with someone from the past or strengthening ties with close people. The recommended action is to open your heart and express your feelings authentically. If there are tensions in any relationship, this is a good time to address them with empathy and understanding. Future Result, The King of Cups The King of Cups points out that, as you release and open to new experiences, you will enter a period of greater emotional balance. This king represents emotional maturity and the ability to handle situations with compassion and wisdom. The future outcome suggests that by releasing the shackles of the past and allowing love and understanding to flow, you will become a stronger, more emotionally secure figure. Today is a day to free yourself from self-imposed limitations, open yourself to new experiences, and seek meaningful connections in your relationships. As you move toward greater emotional balance, the universe will guide you toward a state of greater clarity and understanding. Trust the process and open your heart to the opportunities that arise. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and luck. Work may have lacked its usual spark, Capricorn. The last few months may have been lackluster while Jupiter retrograde in Taurus was going on. You may have lost your creative touch since a blockage may have ensued. The hot flirting with your cute co-worker may become lukewarm during this retrograde. Luckily, there is a chance to turn it all around when Jupiter stations direct in Taurus today. You may feel more inspired with your passion projects and become more flirtatious with your work crush once again over the next few months. It's important to keep a good perspective of your finances and recognize where you may be struggling on an emotional level so take some time to jot down your thoughts today. Try not to let negative thoughts get on top of you. The more you think, sit back and analyze from a distance, the better you will feel overall. Discussing plans and options with others can be very helpful. The more you talk about what is bothering you, the better you will come to terms with things, and the more likely you are to find good solutions. The tarot gives you your lucky number. Your lucky numbers for January 2nd are 11, 47, 51, 22, 46, 30. Daily Love Sweet Venus, our goddess planet of relationships and romance, has ventured into newfound territory, Capricorn. As she dances into your solar 12th house of privacy and the unconscious until January 23, 2024, 
you are being given a chance to reflect on how you've built your personal and romantic life in the past year. Be sure to pay attention to your intuition now, it will be speaking volumes of insight to you regarding your heart's desires. If you need to heal or release any baggage around your personal life or relationships, speaking with a therapist now could do wonders. The moon is in Leo and in your 8th house of partnership today, however it is also trining Neptune in your 3rd house of communication. This is emphasizing the necessity of having honest, open and clear lines of communication open with your partner in order to experience closeness and establish a strong and lasting connection. How are you at expressing your feelings and thoughts in your intimate partnerships? Do you find it easy to share those things or do you tend to keep things to yourself? Today is a great time to reflect on these questions and work on practicing more transparency and clarity in the way you communicate with your partner, as that can be the determining factor of whether a relationship succeeds or not. At work. You are an ambitious person with the capability of keeping things well organized in addition to chasing your dreams. But others are not so. And you must not tell them to be so, that is up to time. So just resist this urge else you will be mistaken to be interfering in other people's lives. Bring your attention to your business partnerships. What's the nature of your relationships with those whom you work with? Today the moon is in Leo and in your 8th house. Can you afford to compromise more in your interactions with others? A necessary ingredient to achieving what you want in your career is working alongside others. And you can't make that happen if you want everything to go your way. Also, maybe it's the opposite way around for you, do you tend to compromise too much giving the other person precedence over yourself? Find the balance between those essential traits. The moon is also trining Neptune in your third house, highlighting the importance of being skillful in your communication abilities, as that helps determines the nature of your relationships. Health. You are going to find someone today who will become a very good exercise buddy for you. You may already know this person but now you will discover this shared interest. Your mutual enthusiasm will help you to drive yourself further so that your health and fitness will be at its peak. You may also take part in an athletic event now. During this transit, Capricorn should focus on finding balance between their work and personal life. Set healthy boundaries and make time for self-care practices, like taking a relaxing bath or engaging in a hobby you enjoy. You may also benefit from incorporating grounding foods, like root vegetables or lentils, into your diet. Family and friends. Your partner may do something that will increase your confidence in your relationship. You may return the favor by guaranteeing a happy time together. You may have a happy time with your love. You may eat out together. Take time to introduce your partner to your family. Remember slow and steady wins the race. Weigh everyone's mood before taking a step. A special someone could have an almost hypnotic control over you today, and it doesn't look like there's any reason to deny them this power, provided they don't abuse it, of course. Romantic Venus is coming together with the intuitive moon for one of their twice-a-month trines, blending their powerful energies together to create something incredibly seductive. Since these two heavenly bodies will be aligning in your relationship sectors it wouldn't be at all surprising if a special someone leads you down a deeply alluring path into, well, you're not exactly sure where. That's the exciting thing about this transit, it gives you the chance to excavate something truly riveting, preferably with a bedroom buddy there to give you a hand. Compatibility. At work Leo. In love Libra. In luck Virgo. Your lucky color today. Orange. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.